You get constant reminders when you go in public and see people throwing garbage on the ground, uh, drinking bottled water and just tossing it. Like, this disappointing, really. I wanted to do something more um, technical, more hands-on. Kids don't grow up saying, I want to be a water or wastewater operator. So the idea was to create a program that was specifically for that. So this program makes it easier to transition the students into the work environment. This is a lab section uh, of the course, and today we are uh, doing a lab uh, exercise 2.1, which is uh, pressure instrumentation. The students are uh, hooking up pressure instruments, taking readings from them, and uh, generally getting familiar with how pressure instruments work. We focus a lot on operations of water plants and wastewater plants, and the distribution of water and the collection of wastewater. Uh, but some of our students have also moved into the compliance and regulatory components of it, so meeting or ensuring that the plants are meeting all the requirements that were set out after the Walkerton inquiry and the legislation changes that followed. The interesting thing is in the first year in the introduction to water wastewater, we actually cover the entry level drinking water certification program, which is an embedded Ministry of Environment program. So when students complete that successfully, they already get this entry level drinking water certificate from the ministry, which most people will have to do after they've graduated from a program or finished school somewhere else. It was a little nerve wracking at the beginning, but professors make it really easy. There is some math, there is some chemistry, there is some microbiology and I always tell the students not to worry because I'm not a huge math person, I'm not a huge chemistry person but what I find about the math, the chemistry is that it's very applicable so you can really relate it to what you're doing and then it all seems to fall into place and make sense. This course I chose particular because there's always going to be a need for treatment of water and wastewater, so I'm looking into uh, the security of a job. There's job opportunities all over the country. My definition of success is just being happy with what you're doing. Durham College is fabulous for building relationships and, and really looking out for student success. Durham College and the instructors, they've helped me define what success is, and I know that I will do well.